Hi and welcome to Shosu's classes. Today we are going to be doing some very important sums on correlation analysis of quantitative statistics. You can WhatsApp or call us at the number given on the screen for queries, doubts or for full videos on our courses. Let's see our first question. Starting off with a very easy question, covariance of the following data are given. Rather, they need to be found out. Sigma xi equals to 55, sigma yi equals to 74, sigma xi yi equals to 411 and n equals to 11. Now, according to formula, covariance x comma y equals to 1 by n summation xi yi minus 1 by n summation x summation y i now putting in the values we have 1 by 10 into 411 minus 1 by 10 into 55 into 74 or 1 by 10 into 411 minus 407 and that upon calculation comes to 0. Point four. That is option number A. Now the next question is kind of a critical one. If capital U and capital V are such that UI cap equal UI equals to XI minus A and VI equals to YI minus B, then covariance U comma V is let's see how to do this. We're given the above formulas. Now, xi equals to small ui plus a and yi equals to vi plus b. Substituting these values in the formula, we have covariance x comma y equals to 1 by n summation xi yi minus 1 by n summation xi summation yi we get covariance xy equals to 1 by n into summation ui plus a into let me write it a bit clearly ui plus a plus vi plus b minus 1 by n summation ui plus a into summation vi plus b This equals 1 by n summation ui vi plus a vi plus b ui plus ab minus summation ui plus na plus na. into summation vi plus nb now fa fast forwarding it to all the calculations in just a second i have done the further calculations so that it becomes faster for you please check and try to understand each and every process thus covariance x comma y is equals to covariance uv after substituting the values of xi and yi from the equations that we had derived. This will be number C from the MCQs that we had. In the next question we have u plus 5x equals to 6 and 3y minus 7v equals 20. 
and the correlation coefficient between x and y is 0.58 then what will the correlation coefficient between u and v we know that u equals to x minus a by b and v equals to y minus c by b therefore rx rxy equals to bd mod b mod t r uv u equals to minus 5x plus 6 equals to x minus 6 by 5 by minus 1 by 5 thus v equals to y minus 20 by 3 by 7 by 3 here b equals to minus 1 by 5 and d equals to 7 by 3 therefore r u v equals to mod b into mod d by b d which is equals to r x y which is equals to minus 1 since b equals to minus 1 by 5 and d equals to 7 by 3 are of opposite signs therefore r u x equals to minus r x y which equals minus 0 0.58 now we'll do a sum on rank correlation if the rank correlation coefficient between marks in management and mathematics for a group of students is 0 0.6 and the sum of squares of the difference in ranks is 66. What is the number of students in the group? Therefore, r equals to 1 minus 6 summation d square by n into n square minus 1 is equals 0 0.6 equals to 1 minus 6 into 66 by n into n square minus 1 or n into n square minus 1 equals to 990 which equals 10 into 100 minus 1 which is equals to 10 into 10 square minus 1 or from here we can analyze that n equals to 10 as n must be a positive integer therefore option number a is the correct answer With this we come to an end of another great video. Please like, subscribe and click on the notification button. You can also contact us at the given number via WhatsApp or call. For any queries, questions, doubts or for full videos on our courses.